It was a lovely late summer's day. I was basically cycling to work. I stopped at the head of traffic lights on red. And an Arctic lorry um, knocked me down. The next thing I knew, I was on my back. Took me under the wheel, and I, I knew I'd lost my leg at the scene. My first contact, of course, when I came out of hospital, was with the insurers, and they put me in touch with Minster Law. Minster Law completely changed my life. It's given me my life back. The customer is at the heart of everything that we do at Minster Law. It's obviously a focus on delivering the best outcome for clients. When we do the right things for those customers and provide that, that great service, we put people back on track. This last year has been a real year of change for Minster Law on many levels. Externally, we've been working hard to prepare the business for the reforms that will happen in the marketplace, which will see the way in which we do our work really significantly change. So we've made huge investments in our IT infrastructure to really try and repurpose our whole IT and delivery capability. On an internal level, we've had a lot of change as we make the exciting transition to one Yorkshire site. And here we find ourselves within Kingfisher House, totally repurposed and ready to take the business on its next challenges in the year ahead. The optimised customer journey for us is one where the customer has to do as little as possible, where we can deploy smart technology and great people so that the customer has choice of how they interact with us. So it's on their terms, not ours, really. Minster Claims is a really exciting piece of development work. We're expecting that solutions that come out of that will benefit the whole of the operation. And we're really targeting our customers to have the best possible journey. We're constantly told that this is the only proposition that tries to tackle this from a customer's perspective. And we're constantly told that this is the answer for the future. It's been a big year in terms of investment in people. Things that we've seen real improvements in are around how our managers interact with their staff. They want the best people and the best roles and they really encourage internal progression for that reason. And it never stops, it's always ongoing, you're always learning. There is that support network around you to ensure that you develop in the right areas. The Back to Biking campaign is an incentive that was brought out by Minster Law last year with the intention of getting motorcyclists back on the road and ride their bikes again when they've suffered psychological injuries. And uh, the client that did it last year was delighted with what had gone ahead and how the, the process worked as well. When I was in hospital, I was looking for a way to help other amputees. Personal Truths is a hub that you can actually go to to discuss the traumas and things like that, or just go get help, your legal advice. And obviously it's different for different people, but I can give them a bit more comfort and a bit more detail of what my experience of it is. To me, what we do with our CSR activity at Minister is, is really important. We do a lot to improve lives of obviously our customers that have been in accidents. So being able to improve lives of people in our local communities, it fits with exactly what we do. You see that they've really bought into why they're doing it. They're not just doing it for a tick box, they're doing it because they actually care. Minster Law's always been a unique business and that's why I'm really proud to be leading on to its next challenge. And I say unique because we have a really fantastic blend of legal expertise and expertise from colleagues who have worked in different industries. For me the thing that makes Minster Law is the people. Everybody wants to work hard for themselves but also for the business. They care about each other. Yeah, I think it's more like a little family at Minster. There's a real sense of pride. It's about obviously giving back and doing everything you can for your customers. Everybody that I work with is wholly committed to making this business a success. I've been here five and a half years and I absolutely love it. I say I'm going to retire here because I absolutely <laughs> adore it. I really do. I adore this place. The huge advantage is that I'm working with a business that is keen uh, to invest, is keen to support uh, and wants to push forward. And I'm really proud of the journey that we've been on to become a much more customer-centric business. I'm absolutely confident that whatever challenge and opportunity comes our way, we will succeed. Yeah.